Here are the instructions for downloading Bridge Designer onto your computer if you are not using a school computer. Again, if you are using a school computer, you're going to go to the Start menu, go down to My Applications, to Bridge Designer. But if you are not on a school computer, you do not have Bridge Designer on there. So in this week's folder, there's a folder called Look Here. If you're not using a school laptop, click on that folder. Bridge Designer installation for non-school computers. So here are the directions. That's where this video is going to be. You have set up bdv16j.exe. Go ahead and click on that and it will have another file set up bdv16j.exe. Click on that and it will download it to your computer. When that is done, download it to your computer. You're going to open it. If your computer has a password, put the password in. I'm on a school computer, you should not see that. Here's all the licensing agreement. I agree. Bridge Designer, register file extension, hit next. This is where it's going to put it on your computer, hit next. Hit install. And now Bridge Designer should be on your computer. So when you go to the start menu, now you have Bridge Designer 2016 on your computer. If you click on that, you've got Bridge Designer 2016 second edition. There's two versions of it. One of them says for older computers, you can probably click the first one right there. You click on that and there you go. There is Bridge Designer 2016 on your computer. If you're not able to do that, unfortunately, I can't, uh, you know, troubleshoot every single computer. That's why we have school computers. You can run up to the school and grab a school laptop if you need to in order to get it working. Uh, Bridge Designer works best for screens. Resolution of that is usable down to that. Your screen has that resolution. Would you like to continue? Just hit yes. And then here you go in Bridge Designer and you're good to go.